It's August, oh, it's busy, and we've come to Puerto del Carmen, and we can't go to Puerto del Carmen without doing you a drive-by. Now, that doesn't mean getting a machine gun out and shooting everybody. That means drive-by, as in we will show you Puerto del Carmen. So, we're starting up the top end, uh, Bollywood's great Indian restaurant. You've got a big bar up the top called 67, um, and here, on the right hand side is where Musical Tavern is. So you've got a few places in there, you've got the Codfather, you've got Musical Tavern, you've got the Little Elm, and you see there is plenty of people around. Look at this, there's something new being built there which I will have to investigate and find out. It looks like there's some apartments at the top which look lovely, and underneath is gonna be something big by the looks of it. You've also got the big shopping centre that's at right at the other end. That's open now. Uh, we'll, we'll do a video of that shortly. Massive Italian restaurant here. It's what time is it? It's 10.30 in the morning. So people are just getting up, getting around and about, um, looking for breakfast. Having a little look in the tat shops, look. Seeing what they can buy for the day. And it's a beautiful day. It's 25 degrees at the moment. The car is there. Uh, confirming 25 degrees and it's very very nice there's not a cloud in the sky um, what we got in this area here this area in here I think you've got you've got a few places there and um, I don't know many of them to be to be honest and um, you've got a big one here called the California bar that's uh, usually very very busy plenty of space outside and coming up on the right hand side is one that I don't understand but everybody loves it it's Mr. Pasta it goes viral, that place does, on social media. Everybody giving it amazing reviews. And I tell you what, I've never seen anybody post a plate of pasta. So the name is really weird. Uh, and everyone says it, the name puts them off, but the food is incredible. So if you want to try the food, go and see Mr. Pasta. You've got Serenities here. This is brand new as well. Again, it opened, there was a bit of a there was a bit of a hype about it and I've not heard much since. I will have to get back up there and have a little nosy around. It's very posh and I've heard it's very expensive as well. But there's plenty going on. Look at this. Oh, here's the new uh, other Italian restaurant look that's opened. Last time we passed that, they didn't have the sign up but it all looks very glam and it's right next to Goofy Burger. Very popular place is Goofy. We're gonna carry on, look. Got the good old days coming up upstairs. And one of our favorite places for people watching, El Kiosco, always busy. Very, very popular with the locals. And there's the bank. <laughs> Not that you're interested in the bank, but I tell you what, it's always a queue outside there. And then also down here, just on the corner, you've got La Delicatessa. This is the cocktail bar that does all the amazing cocktails all the tricks and the stunts and all that sort of stuff and they serve some weird and wonderful things there's loads and loads going on so there you go folks we are in Puerto del Carmen today if you're around come and find us say hello don't forget to like and follow our channels on all the social medias because we'll keep you up to date it's a little bit quiet down this area but it is early in the morning. We're gonna end our tour at the Centro Atlantico. Plenty of people at the bus stop. It's 10.36. I'll tell you what these lot are waiting for. They're waiting for the bus to the Aqua Park in Costa de Guise because that's the time of the pickup. There you go, guys. Have a lovely day. We'll see you in the next video. Here we go, part two of Puerto del Carmen and we're starting down by the Rocas Blancas great little place for people watching that you can sit outside all day long and just watch the world go by beautiful restaurants this end of town as well you've got the royal and pinocchio's does cracking steak in there with a secret ingredients of the pepper sauce always ask for the pepper sauce in there oh let's let this bus go don't want to get in trouble do we so this is Centro Atlantico, folks, and we're stuck behind the bus, so I'll tell you a little bit about it. Centro Atlantico is the hub of the nightlife. It's where all the parties are. So if you want to go clubbing, pubbing, and stuff like that, Centro is the place for you. They have a bit of live music. They have your disco bars. Um, they literally have everything in there. 
Um, Atlantico Homes, if you want a property. I don't know whether that's open actually, but there's plenty of property available there. And the very famous American Indian Cafe here. Great for your burgers, your ribs. And it's owned by the same company that owns La Ancla in the old town, Puerto del Carmen, down by the harbour. Up the top, you've got the big wok, so you can get yourself a, a buffet Chinese. And next to that is La Rustica, which is your pizza place. Very famous in Playa Blanca, but they're trying to break into Puerto del Carmen as well. Will they do it? Who knows? Another big Chinese restaurant, enjoy. And if you've got plenty of Wonga in your pocket, Santos will sell you a Rolex and Mint will sell you a designer top and shoes to go with it. That's right next door to Route 66. Very busy today. It's a Wednesday afternoon. It's 32 degrees. It's bloody roasting. So you can see loads of people are sitting outside enjoying a drink, grabbing some lunch and just cooling off. The beach is really busy as well. That's on the other side of the road. Uh, I'm not going to get Jack to swing the camera around. Um, but there's loads of people down on the beach. In fact, I can see about 20 pedalos out. Nice little British bars down in this place. You've got the Sea View and also the Tavern. They do like all your quiz nights and bingo and stuff like that. So these are sort of British, British bars down in this area. And of course, you've got your Buccaneer and next to that, one of the Irish bars, Shenanigans. Look how many tables and chairs are outside there. We're heading towards the brand new Mercadona as well. Now this is the big shopping centre. I have shown it in other videos and I will get in there to go and have a good look. But today we've got certain things to do so we haven't got time. Plenty of nice places upstairs here as well, just in this area. You've got your um, Sunset Beach Bar, um, all different sort of bars for your food and your drink there as well. And then coming towards what we suppose we call the end of the new town strip. You've got a few different bars and restaurants. You've got the Blue Marlin, you've got the Galleon, you've got your Scottish bar, Blue Bells, coming up on the right. And for all your sports, you've got your Lineker's bar. So that brings us sort of to the end of the new town or the strip of Puerto del Carmen from Central Atlantico. And we're just gonna take you a little bit further up and we're gonna show you this new shopping center, which is the new Mercadona, the new big supermarket in Puerto del Carmen. I wish they'd open one in Playa Blanca, but that's yet to come. But look at this place, absolutely huge. I believe there's gonna be other shops in there as well, where you can do a bit of shopping. But at the moment, it's got a great big car park and a huge Mercadona, which is a good supermarket. Um, I still prefer Lidl, if I'm honest, in Puerto del Carmen. And of course, up this end of town, you've got the big mango, the Funda Grube with the yellow elephant, and then we're heading in to the old town of Puerto del Carmen towards the harbour. There you go, folks. Make sure to like, subscribe and follow. And we'll see you in the next video.